Prince Harry and Prince Andrew plot to overthrow the monarchy in revenge for being abandoned by the royal family. A new article reports that Prince Harry and Prince Andrew are hell-bent on revenge for their oustings from the British royal family. Prince Harry deliberately destroying the monarchy. According to the latest issue of The Globe, renegade Prince Harry and scandal-scarred Prince Andrew are working to bring down the royal family, and specifically want to make sure their brothers will never be king. A high-level palace courtier tells the outlet, Andrew and Harry's shocking exploits have brought so much disgrace, shame and controversy to the family, it's unlikely the monarchy can survive after Queen Elizabeth dies. The source goes on to say, public pressure is mounting every day for the royal family to be stripped of their titles and abolished. And the blame lies squarely with Harry and Andrew. The courtier adds, this would be a devastating end for an institution that has endured for centuries, and a personal heartbreak for Her Majesty, who has ruled for 68 of her 94 years. While there have long been claims that the royal family should be abolished by some Britons, Queen Elizabeth is as popular as ever, and Prince William is also very popular. There is no reason to believe that Prince Andrew's legal situation or Prince Harry's split from the family have affected the future of the crown. The two-page spreads then recounts what amounts to old news and typical tabloid tropes about Prince Harry and Prince Andrew. The paper alleges that every step Prince Harry and his wife, Meghan Markle, take is intended to destroy the monarchy. A so-called insider makes a previously debunked claim that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are planning to release secret recordings they made as they made plans to step down as senior royals. That claim isn't true. Prince Andrew, on the other hand, does have more serious issues to contend with, given his alleged involvement with Jeffrey Epstein but there is no indication he is trying to destroy the monarchy because of it. In fact, after the Queen forced him to step back from his duties, he has nearly vanished. He's made very few public appearances and even fewer public statements. In what way is he working to keep his brother, Prince Charles, from ascending? He's not. Prince Harry, likewise, is not working to undermine his own brother's eventual ascension either. In fact, he is doing all he can to build his own life in California. The only people obsessed with Prince Harry's supposed motives are the tabloid media that are desperate to pin unfair and false accusations on the Duke. This tabloid, and every other tabloid, simply have no insight into either prince's lives, much less that they are scheming to tear down the institution so important to both. This tabloid has a bad track record with the truth. The Globe has been corrected many many times by us in the past. In fact, almost exactly a year the tabloid falsely claimed Prince Charles had seized the crown from Queen Elizabeth II. The story claimed the heir apparent was taking over for his mother due to her ill health. The story was completely bogus at the time. Of course, a year later, that story seems even more ludicrous.